Hey, it's Dave. I'm just going to go over some basic vertical utility, so let's hop right into it. With the first spawn, you could smoke uh, bottom A ramp pass like this. With the second spawn, you can smoke bottom A ramp pass like this. With the third spawn, you could smoke bottom A ramp pass like this. Fourth spawn, you could smoke bottom A ramp pass like this. Oh. And with the fifth spawn, you could smoke bottom A ramp fast like this. Uh, now these smokes are really good to throw fast because it allows you to lay down fast smoke. plays off of them. Um, the main thing to know about the smoke is just that there's no gap in the bottom of the so to see through. And yeah, as far as fast plays, I would probably either have to go Ivy fast or to go ramp fast. For Ivy, I would have you know, one player Flash throwing back. a self flag and swinging out, and the other player swinging with them. For ramp, I would have the first player probably throwing a self flag like back. this, and then jumping down uh, and playing up on the smoke, and then have the second player probably swing bottom ramp here. And um, yeah, and I'd have a third player throwing support util. So if they were swinging ramp, I'd probably throw these flashes, like here. Flash back. Um, and then if they were swinging the ivy, I would probably throw, like, back of this, like, yellow square. I'd probably throw these flashes for swinging ivy. Um, the reason why I really like these ones for swinging ivy is because they, A, they pop closer, and B, sometimes an opera will crouch here, and they'll, uh, try to pop you while you're swinging ivy, and the traditional flashes won't get them, so this one will definitely get that. Um, so let's talk about T-side. So from T-spawn, um, I think Ivy smoke's really good to have. Um, just right now, like that's kind of like a good smoke that your team can always work off of. Uh, there's a really cool smoke over here, like, um, where you line up with this pillar. Uh, it's right fast right left side, A side, which is cool. Um, yeah, and then I, there's some mid utility that I've been seeing where you can come out mid and let's say you like double walk late mid, you have this position, you could smoke up, kind of the mid lurk smoke, you could go really deep uh, there and you could also, you can, if you want to actually commit, uh, you could nade and flash here. And the reason why I like this Molotov uh, is that it's going to actually burn off this player because a lot of people will like stand up here and kind of hold uh, for the window peak. Um, and let's just talk about, like I guess, like a standard A execute and a standard B execute nade set. So let's say you like, defaulted, took a control, volleyed out sandbag, had all this control, and you're like, okay, time to execute. I usually line up uh, this corner with like, well, not perfectly, but like roughly, like as long as you can't see that bottom ledge. Then I'll aim here for this one, down, I'll molly here, and then usually like flash, like flash back, and then swing with the flash. Um, I like that Molotov because people like can't jump up with it without being in the Molotov the whole time. Um, yeah, and then for the left side smoke, it's just from back here, uh, and you aim here. Right and then for B, uh, at B site, let's say you kind of took out all of this control, um, I would smoke right side jam like this, oh. and then I would have another nade set where you line up the circle, you crouch, you jump right through for left side gen, and you aim here for fire. fire. Molly, flash bang pops up, flash sight, and flash, flash back bang. of sight while your rifles are swinging. Um, yeah, so I think that would be a pretty sweet <laughs> way to uh, execute B and A. Um, those are some fast names, so thank you for tuning in, and hope to see you in the next one. Bye.